It's another Cool Tips Tuesday, and today we're going to show you something that you can do with your columns in response of you that we're pretty sure you didn't know about. Well, here I've got this block and I've got four nice columns here. Looks like nice info boxes with icons, text in there. And then what happens if we go into our tablet and phone views? And as you know, this is often a big problem because it squashes things together. If you hover over these columns, you will see the handlebar between the columns where you can make adjustments to the sizing. Let's put it back on 25%. If you go all the way to the right, you will see that this is the end and there's nothing you can do about this border. Let me show you what happens if we go in tablet view. Now, if you go all the way to the right, you will see now there appears a handle drag bar here as well. This allows you to space these elements and I'm gonna put each one on 50% the way you want in response of you. Click on the next one and drag it to 50% or close enough to 50% and same for this one. What a great feature. One I'm pretty sure you didn't know about. And you can do exactly the same for mobile. Now on mobile, you will have by default your columns under each other. But what if you felt that it is good enough to put them next to each other? Then you can do the opposite. You just reduce it over here to around 50% or well, a little bit smaller and same for this one. And they will fit in nicely control in your hands. Hope this was a useful tip for you on this Cool Tuesday Tips.